Our scripture reading today is taken from Matthew chapter 11 verses 28. Come unto me, all ye that labour and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. These are the words of the Lord Jesus himself. He says, come unto me. He didn't say to go unto anyone else with your sins or your burdens or your cures. He says, come unto me. That means children may come. Old people may come, middle-aged may come, and everyone may come. Sometimes in life we get burdened with a load of cure. But the Lord Jesus wants us to bring him our burdens. The hymn writer penned these words, Take your burden to the Lord and leave it there. If you trust and never doubt, he will surely bring you out. Take your burden to the Lord and leave it there when you come up with your problems and your worries whatever it is and explain it to the lord asking for his divine intervention into your situation then don't take it back with you again leave it with the, the lord and a miracle will happen doors will open and very soon you will get an answer to your prayers in John 14, the Lord Jesus said, Whatsoever ye shall ask in my name, that will I do, that the Father may be glorified in the Son. And the Lord Jesus says, If ye ask anything in my name, I will do it. What a promise for you and me to ask and believe and receive it. You shall have it. Sometimes we run to others for advice and help. Sometimes we try to work it out our own way. And yet, when we bring our burdens to the Lord, he can do the impossible and we shall see answers. Maybe you're heavy laden about some wayward son or daughter. Take it to the Lord in prayer. Maybe you're worried about your children's future. Take it to the Lord in prayer. In Mark 10 verse 14, the Lord Jesus said, Suffer the little children to come unto me, and forbid them not, for of such is the kingdom of heaven. In Mark 10 also we read about a man who came running to the Lord Jesus asking, What must I do to inherit eternal life? He wanted to know for sure he was going to heaven when he died. He had kept all the commandments, but that didn't fit him for heaven. There was just one thing in his life that kept him back for was his possessions the lord jesus told him to go thy way sell whatever you have and give to the poor and thou shalt have treasure in heaven and come take up thy cross and follow me he went away very sad what's holding you back today what one thing is holding you back from coming to the lord jesus christ let it go it's not worth it imagine being lost for all eternity May the Lord bless his word to all our hearts for his name's sake. Amen.